hey everyone welcome back to another new exciting video many of you already know that some days ago cloud code blocked the third party access to their uh, some hundred dollar and 200 plan and there was a cloud opus 4.5 model and also cloud sonnet 4.5 but here you see that i am using this cloud opus 4.5 and also sonnet 4.5 through anti-gravity why anti-gravity because those who have used the anti-gravity uh, ID they already know that there you can use the Claude Sonnet and Opus 4.5 for free and guys one thing this video might be lengthy but it will be very much useful for you because you will all learn you will learn a lot of things the step by step process how to install it and if 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 you face any issue then how to debug it you will learn a lot of things okay so please watch the video take your time and do the setup and it is 100% free and you don't have to pay anything and you will be able to uh, do the setup inside this open code not only open code inside cursor windsurf or whatever uh, third party id you are using you can do the setup and you can use this cloud opus 4.5 and sonnet 4.5 uh, through the anti-gravity okay so as i was telling you that inside anti-gravity this sonnet 4.5 and opus 4.5 is free and also there is a weekly rate limit see rate limit was there in uh, cloud uh, cloud code plan also that hundred dollar and two hundred dollar plan there was a, also a rate limit so rate limit is not that pain issue and the main motto of this video is that to show you that how to use this opus 4.5 for free sonnet 4.5 for free uh, through the google anti-gravity so for that what i have to do that um, I have given one link in description box. This is the GitHub repository, and this is the here you see the open code and anti gravity auth. You will find this page. Okay, so come to this GitHub repository and scroll down below. And after that, here you will find two options for the installation for human, and uh, there is an option A, option B. So if you go to this option A, here you see that let an LLM do it. So I will suggest you to go uh, for this option A because here you have to just copy this prompt. Okay, so here you see that this is the prompt, just copy it and after that open the open code or you can open the cursor or wind serve and after that just select any model. Okay, so inside open code uh, you will find this GLM 4.7 is freely available to use. So select this GLM 4.7. So when you will op uh, open the open code, let me uh, first start this. Okay. So if I just open this open code, then you will find the default screen. Okay. So default screen is this. So here you see that this is a slash. So just click on this slash, and after that you will find this screen. Select this GLM 4.7, and after that the prompt that we have copied from here and just paste it here okay so just paste it and now press enter and now you will see the magic that how step by step it will complete the full installation Okay, now it is telling that uh, to complete the setup, run open code auth login. So I have also seen this same kind of command here in this GitHub repository. Here you see open code auth login. Okay, let me run this, but where I will run this? I think inside this uh, terminal. So let me open this CMD and inside this, uh, let me run this. Open code is not recognized as an internal external command. So I don't know here, I need to run it. Or do I have to run it inside this terminal? So let me run again. Okay, so here I can run this. 
it is asking that at credential select provider which provider should i choose the google because i will use the anti-gravity right so if i use uh, if i want to use the anti-gravity then i need the google right what it is telling here uh at model see the available models for full list okay uh, uh, uh here cloud sonnet name the response ready got one notification okay here you see open code is waiting for you select a provider select google in the interactive prompt to authenticate your google account okay so it is also guiding me okay so select google enter your api key enter your api key okay so i will get my api key i think from the google ai studio let me open that let me open that ai studio see guys i am doing all of that things uh, this setup in front of you step by step process so that you can understand so please give a like this video so i am keeping this video very transparency so that you can understand the step by step process on the right hand side i have this create api key okay choose a default project create key So it has created a key right january 12 today free tier completely free tier okay now here enter your api key pasting my api key press enter done it is done right it is done okay if it is done then what i can do go to again this open code run hello model uh, use it open code run hello model google anti-gravity cloud sonnet 4.5 thinking variant max okay copy this okay let's see let's see if it is working or not so it is telling me that cloud sonnet 4.5 thinking variant max max variant okay so uh, let me let me ask here that now what to do done now what to do now what to do okay now what to do okay it is also asking me that test the installation by uh, just running this okay i have already copied the same things from this repository so so let me open it and run this open code run let's see provider model not found error i am getting error here so it is telling me that here inside this provider.ts getting some error okay so let me ask the same thing here run this okay if i just ask this open code to run this instead of manually then see that what it is doing actually if you uh, go to their github repository the repository i have shared with you so here you see that if you do it manually then you have to do this add the plugin to your open code.json and then authenticate it and then you have to add this provider you see that provider google model this this but uh, as i am doing it through open code so that's why it is taking some time okay okay the good news is that now here you see excellent the anti-gravity models are now showing up let me run in the test command again it is running that test command i think for the cloud sonnet 4.5 Okay, the model is recognized now, but there is an API error. This could be authentication issue for or the model. Let's see. Okay, so it is telling me that again run the open code auth login and select the Google when prompted, not the open code gen. I also previously selected this open code, right? Open code auth login again. Okay select the google select the google o with okay now here you see that now i have got this o auth with google anti-gravity is showing okay oh previously i i actually entered the uh, api key you remember that previously i entered the api key from the um, google ai studio but uh, this time it is uh, giving me this option but previously for the first time it was not giving this uh, anti-gravity option right so okay it is good now let's select this anti-gravity project id leave blank okay i have selected my account that is registered with the google anti-gravity so after that uh, when you, you will select your account you will find this message that all said you have successfully authenticated with the anti-gravity you can return to open code close this okay 
cannot be closed automatically okay fine minimize this add another account no i don't want to add another account in login successful done okay now it is done and what i will tell you uh, i will tell this uh, open code now it is done done now what's next what's next now i have to test the anti gravity model okay so it will running it will run that okay it will run that okay i have got the response okay here you see that i have got the response the anti gravity model is now working okay i hope now it will work here also so let me uh, run this let me run this let me run this hey, hey. yes here you see that i have got the uh, response hello I am open quote ready to help with your software engineering task. What would you like to work on today? Anti gravity cloud sonnet 4.5. I am using. I hope that I will get this model uh, here also. Okay, let's see. Uh, 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 UI, uh, okay, here I am not getting, but uh, what it is telling me plugin install and configure. You can now use anti gravity model. Google anti gravity, anti gravity. Okay, Gemini 3 Pro, Gemini 3 Flash, Cloud Sonnet 4.5, Cloud Sonnet 4.5 Thinking, Low Max variant, and also Opus 4.5. Let's see, guys. Opus 4.5 I can use, right? Open Opus 4.5. Okay, let's let's do one thing. Let's modify this and uh, paste these things. Okay, Opus 4.5. Because ultimately, Open Code got blocked from using the Opus 4.5, right? Let's see it. So let me modify this. Modify, modify this portion only, right? Modify only this portion. So instead of sonnet, instead of sonnet, I will use the anti gravity. Instead of sonnet, I will use the anti gravity. Okay. Run this. So I'm giving this hello. Okay. Let's see. Here you see that I have got this response. Hello, how can I help you today from the Cloud Opus 4.5 thinking? So from uh, this um, open quote, I can access the anti gravity Cloud Opus 4.5 model. Okay. Now the thing is that these uh, models are not coming here in this drop down. Let's see that if I can access anti gravity, okay, it's not coming here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me let me ask one question here. But I am not uh, getting this model. This model. This anti gravity models. Anti gravity models in drop down let's see if it can suggest me some of the turnaround or not verify anti-gravity models are listed so this model is listed when using cli okay 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 so it is say, telling me that the models are available in the cli but may not appear in the ui drop down due to caching restart that ui okay so i it is telling me that if I use the CLI by using this open code, uh, then I will be able to see this anti gravity model. But if I want to see it inside this UI drop down, then I need to restart it. Fine. Fine. I will restart it. No problem. So I have closed it. I have closed it, right? Now, what I will do? I will run this. So open code. Open code. Yes. Starting the server. Okay. One, two, three start so how will i get oh my god oh my god i have got this model cloud opus 4.5 thinking from the anti-gravity okay so here you see that from this anti-gravity i have got this gemini 3 plus gemini 2.5 plus cloud sonnet 4.5 and also this cloud opus 4.5 thinking model okay so if i select this cloud opus 4.5 thinking and if i just write hi Will I get response? Yes. Hello, how can I help you with your coding today? So here you see guys, I am using this Cloud Opus 4.5 from anti-gravity. Okay. So I think that this detailed video with detailed steps, step-by-step -step process that I have explained, it will help you a lot to debug and also it will help you to set up this anti-gravity within the open code. And if you found this video helpful guys, don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe this channel. So see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. And all of this link are given in the description box. Okay.